welcome back um second part of my haul that was up earlier um yeah so this part of the haul i have forever 21 dsw and ulta so yeah be excited <laughs> so i'll start off with forever 21 um and once again i have found a new love in forever 21 and i spent a good hour and a half in there and i didn't buy as much as i thought i was going to but that's okay um i got a couple shirts the first thing I got was this sweater. It's just plain black, um, and it's got a zipper <laughs> right here. Uh, it actually zips, which is kind of surprising instead of just, like, for show or whatever. But, yeah, it's kind of, the sweater, I'm, I don't know. <laughs> the sweater is looser fitting. Um, I got the reflection right in your face right there. Um, yeah, it's looser fitting, and it's really comfy. And I'm going to wear it with my black boots. So, yeah, I'm pretty excited about this. And this was $15.80 from their tr Love Tree one. Is this Forever 21? Yep. Well, I bought it at Forever 21. Love Tree. Second thing I got was this sweater, which reminds me of Victoria's Secret sweater, but I saw it on a mannequin, and it was dressed really cute, and I really liked it. So, um, yeah, it's... It just says university on it, and it says Love Tree State of Mind. See, this is Love Tree, too. It, it must be for 21. It just must be a different, um, like, branch of Forever 21, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, and it's just long sleeve navy blue, and I like it, and it's comfy. Oh, and this was, I keep forgetting, 1980. So this was actually kind of expensive, but that's okay. Then I got this t-shirt, and it's Forever 21, and it says, I'm sure. <laughs> I thought it was really cute. I'm wanting to wear it under a black sweater that I have, just to kind of dress up the sweater a little bit. And this was 980, and the material is, like, really soft, and I like it, so. <laughs> and then I got this top. It says, in style, we trust. And I like the black and white, but then it has a couple, like, things of red in it. And I really like it. And it's very lightweight and, as you can see, see-through. And it was thirteen eighty. So. And then I got a couple things of jewelry. I got this ring. And it's just a flower, and it's really sparkly. And it's size 7. <laughs> Yeah, and I just wore my rings on my middle fingers, so that's where I wear it. And this was five eighty. And then I got this necklace, and this is just a plain silver heart, and it's sparkly because I wear my sir my silver necklaces all the time. So I just got another one just to kind of mix it up because I only have like one one silver necklace that I wear. I said silver necklaces, but I meant silver necklace. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, I thought that was pretty. And then I also got a gold necklace, and this was two eighty dollars as well, and it's just a key and a heart, and the heart is like a cream color. It's pretty though, and I really like it. So yeah. I love Forever 21, by the way. <laughs> I said that before, but I love it. <laughs> and then at DSW, I got a pair of boots from White Mountain, that I guess is the name of the brand and they are just plain black suede boots and they got a little bit of a heel on them but I couldn't tell by walking in them and then they got this cute little button detail right here and they're just kind of bunched up and I just love wearing I had a pair of ba black boots that I bought about two years ago um they were black suede they were taller than this and I wear them all the time but they were getting kind of dirty and nasty looking so I figured I better get a, I better get a different pair so yeah and these were um, $59.95. They were in the sale area of DSW, but I didn't get a sale on them, so I don't think they were meant to be back there, but that's okay. And then at Ulta, I decided to get a new perfume because um, every time I go shopping and when we're in Sephora or wherever, I always put this perfume on. And my mom finally was like, why don't you just get it? Because you love it so much. And I always talk about it. So I got the DKNY Be Delicious Green Apple Perfume. Because it smells so good. And I love it. 
and I just got the smallest one so it doesn't actually have the little skirt thing on it but um, you just pull it off and it looks like this and it smells so good and I love it and they have so many different variations on this I think the golden one is out right now but I just love this one so and this was 42 at Ulta and then also at Ulta I needed a new foundation ah, I'm black sorry <laughs> um, I needed a new foundation because my mom had a foundation and I okay story time uh, I've been using tinted moisturizer pretty much since I started wearing makeup because I felt like I didn't need um, foundation and um, one day I just decided no it was for senior pictures I decided I want to put foundation on just to have a little bit of extra coverage and um, just to kind of have a flawless look and the only foundation we had was a L'Oreal true match one um, downstairs and it was my mom's color and I put it on and I was amazed at how good my skin looked I mean it wasn't exactly the right color for me but I was amazed at how much it covered up and how much little concealer I needed to use after I put it on and so I just started wearing it every day and I was just yeah I loved it but I always knew that it wasn't the right color for me it was too dark and a little too orange because the L'Oreal True Match, True Match has a cool, a neutral, and like a warm section. I can't remember what the third one is, but my mom's a neutral tone color, so it was not my skin tone type thing. So it wasn't exactly the right color, but we were in there, and I decided I just wanted to get the same brand because I really liked it, and um, we found my perfect color, and this is in cool. It's a, I guess I'm a cool skin tone, and, and the color is Creamy Natural C3. And I'm wearing it today, and it's perfect, and I love it. Um, so, yeah, and it stays on all the time, like, all day. I was impressed at how long it stays on. And this has SPF 17 sunscreen in it. So, yeah. Um, yeah. I keep saying, um, yeah, I'm <laughs> sorry. And then I was also in the makeup section, and I went into the next section because um, where we went to go shopping is, like, pretty much the only place I have access to um, NYX stuff. So I always try to go in there to get it, but, um, yeah, I got their cream blush, and this is in boho chic, and I'm wearing it today, and I really like it, it's just a really pretty natural pink, and it's almost, like, sticky, um, it reminded me, like, when I was putting it on, it was kind of sticky, but it stayed on, and it was just really natural looking, and I really like it, so, and then I also got a lip gloss, and this is in sugar pie, and it smells so good. Me and Mom were trying to figure out what it smells like exactly. I can't decide. It's like a mix between like sweet tarts and I don't know. But <laughs> it smells so good. And it's a really opaque pink color with a lot of shimmer in it. And I really like it. And then I'm an impulse buyer, <laughs> which is sad. But we were, um, I was getting ready to check out and they had this big section of just, just random things. And, of course, I bought things, but I got the EOS Lip Balm, and this is so cute. Um, this is their Summer Fruits one. It's pink. Um, yes, it's so cute, and I love it. And then I also picked up this Yes to Cucumbers um, facial towelettes, and it's just the travel size one because I wanted to try it out before I got the full size one. I love them. <laughs> um, they took my makeup off perfectly and they made my skin feel really soft after I used them. And I'm definitely going to get the full size. Which So this is actually a good purchase. But yeah. So that is pretty much all I got. Um, I hope you guys like this. <laughs> we'll talk to you later. Bye.